I'm really happy to announce the successful accomplishment of the launch of PSLV C60 for the SpaceX mission. The rocket has placed the satellites in the right orbit, which is 475 kilometers circular orbit. Uh, that's only one part of the mission, uh, injection of the SpaceX satellites. Now, in another 15 minutes, the fourth stage of PSLV will change its orbit from 475 kilometer to 350 kilometer lower orbit by first phase of firing. Uh, and also, the second phase of firing will be at about uh, one hour, 20 minutes later after the liftoff. So that process is continuing to enable POEM operations to happen. Uh, so uh, further to that, uh, the spacecraft is also going to uh, wait for the solar panel deployment. So the team spacecraft is looking at whether the panels are deployed or not. So we'll get a confirmation soon. So as far as we are concerned, the mission is uh, very well as far as the rocket is concerned. So it has placed the satellite in the right orbit. Uh, the SpaceX two satellites are moved. Uh, you would have seen in the animation that they moved a little uh, one behind the other. So over the period of time, for the days, it will pick up further distance, uh, travel to almost a 20 kilometer distance away. And then the rendezvous and docking process will start. Uh, and we hope that the, uh, the docking process can happen in, the, in another one week. Uh, the nominal time is going to be approximately 7th of January. Uh, so I'm waiting for the panel deployment status. I think you have the status. Yes, so I would like to say that the panels of the satellites have been deployed successfully. So congratulations to the entire team uh, of the PSLV project who put the satellite in the right orbit. Uh, also the SpaceX team uh, who worked a very innovative, novel, cost-effective docking demonstration mission using two small satellite bus architecture. So congratulations to them as well. And also two very important parties of this mission is the POEM-4 where we have 24 payloads hosted, which are from uh, the uh, startups, uh, industries, academic institutions, research laboratories, and also from ISRO centers. All the R&D payloads are there waiting for testing in the coming uh, days, in fact, in months. So congratulations to them for successful accomplishment of all the mission objectives through the POEM. Uh, so once again, thank you.